When I was little, my father was famous. He was the greatest samurai in the empire. Hey everybody, Jerry Williams, aka Greater Safety here. Thanks for stopping by. Today we look at number 41 of Eric Dubay's 200 Proofs Earth is Not a Spinning Ball. Dubay says, Similar calculations made from the Cape of Good Hope, South Africa, to Melbourne, Australia, at an average latitude of 35.5 degrees south, have given an approximate figure of over 25,000 miles, which is, again, equal to or greater than the Earth's supposed greatest circumference at the equator. Calculations from Sydney, Australia, to Wellington, New Zealand, at an average of 37.5 degrees south, have given an approximate circumference of 25,500 miles, greater still. According to the ball earth theory, the circumference of the earth at 37.5 degrees southern latitude should be only 19,757 statute miles, almost 6,000 miles less than such practical measurements. Similar calculations? Similar to what? See, now I'm going to point out something that Dubai supporters keep accusing me of, not providing evidence for what is being claimed. So far, in 39, Dubai claimed some old almanac gave a distance between two locations. No one has access to that almanac he referenced. That measurement was off by nearly 20%, and he misrepresented what it meant. In number 40, he presented a measurement from an unknown source that was off by some 46%, and now he speaks of similar calculations. From where? By whom? Seems to me the only thing that will be similar about these supposed calculations is that they'll be off by a high percentage. For something called a proof, there is no evidence being presented here. And as far as anyone can tell, Dubay has just been making up numbers. I would be perfectly justified in saying nothing in response to this because he has all but literally said nothing. Now, just so you all know my process with these and to fill for time, I don't read ahead on these so-called proofs uh, before I do the scripts. I've scanned through them all at some point, but I copy paste the claim into the script and then I write from there. I look at the proof that's in front of me and remember the ones I've done already and write with that in mind. For example, when I wrote the response to number 40 and mentioned Dubai confusing Cape Horn and the Cape of Good Hope, I did so without noticing he mentions the Cape of Good Hope here. And when I did notice, I didn't go back and rewrite it because that was my genuine thought. The next one could be a complete repeat of this one, but I've locked in this script just to preserve what my thoughts were when I first approached it. Even though as I record this, I've already written the next script. This is how I keep things amusing in my head. Just a little look into my process. Anyway, back to number 41. There's nothing to say because as far as I know, he just made this up. Wait, isn't that what I said last time? That's my job! That's what I do! I don't lose! I win! I win! Is there no one on this planet to even challenge me? Maybe you came by to congratulate me on last night's victory. 